hey what is up guys welcome back to my youtube channel in this video i'm going to be showing you how to fix the lenovo k3 note mobiles imei number roll the intro man so if i go to the settings app go to about phone not printing about phone status and yeah the serial number is also actually gone but serial number is not important I am, imei number is very important because without the correct IMEI number, your SIM card won't work. You won't be able to make any calls or even use the mobile data. So if I go to the IMEI information, as you can see, it says unknown. So today we're going to be fixing that. First, you need to get your device's IMEI number. To get the IMEI number, you can actually remove the battery and under the battery, there will be a label and it says all the IMEI number and the serial number too. If you don't want to do that, you can find your IMEI number and the serial number on the phone's box. And just take a photo of it because we will need it in the future. Okay, so we can go back. And also for to fix this, you will need to root your phone. If you don't know how to root your phone, I have a video on how to root the Lenovo K3 Note. I will leave the link in the description if you want to check it out. Next you need to download this APK. On some phones you can just reinstall the stock OS and the serial number and the IMEI number will be fixed. I will also leave the link in the description. I don't know what is it called. It's called Camelephone I guess so. Okay so you need to install that. Again guys you need root. Your device should be rooted for this to work. So now we wait for it to install. It's done installing. Open it up. and grant the root permission okay so here's where you type your phone's IMEI you just take a photo of your IMEI number under the battery or on the phone's box and you need to type it over here so I have the IMEI number on the on, on another phone so we're going to be copying the IMEI number and typing it here and also I am sorry guys you must not show IMEI numbers to anyone I don't know I just read it in Google so I'm not gonna show you my IMEI number so for the IMEI number one you need to type your first IMEI number on the label so mine I'm gonna be typing mine and now you need to type the second IMEI number which is for the second sim slot so I'm going to type that okay after you have typed the correct IMEI number in the given line you need to select apply new IMEIs then select change and now the phone it says that the phone needs to be restarted so let's go ahead and restart the phone so I'm going to be restarting the phone now after you have completed the reboot you can go to the settings app and check if the IMEI number has changed or not and as you can see the IMEI number is changed so now you can use your sim card and it will work even the calls are going to work and also the mobile data connection so basically you have fixed your phone which does not work with the sim card I don't know whatever so thanks for watching guys please like and subscribe and i will see you in the next video bye guys